Hashtag blessed. I kept on seeing that today all over social media. Just everywhere, Twitter, especially Twitter, Twitter, Instagram. But what does it really mean? <laughs> you know, like I was wondering if people really kind of had a feeling <laughs> or they just using it. And on social media, we see it all the time. Can it be a way of like boasting while you're trying to sound humble or is it just common? Let's get into this video. Cartel got me working for the big faces. Federally got my car full of brick cases. Hit the pin with a grin, there ain't no faking. I was picked to my back for my shoelaces. Got out, should've seen the look on they faces. All jealous cause your boy stacking hella paper. Set up by the crew, they done put a banger. In the trunk of my car and left me to hang there. No thing, then attorney went and beat the case. Got a job digging holes for minimum wage. Had a dream that Cato said he proud of me. Stay here, don't leave, keep doing your thing. Quit the drugs, but you know I went back to selling, six times failing. I went back to prison, got my head right, got my bread right. Push these weights like a kilo in a tailpipe. Trying to do right, I got a mission. Trying to get back to my boys in the prison. The old me's gone, I ain't never. What's up guys, my name is JC, I am Ron Strong. If you are new to my channel, make sure you subscribe so you don't miss nothing. If you're part of my team, mi familia, mi raza, then you already know what time it is. Sure, tell us a word about because we're about to take a ride. What's up guys, welcome to another episode of Ron Strong. All in his name, all in his glory, Thank you, Jesus, for what you did on the cross for me. Happy Friday. It is Friday. Man. Man, I love God, you know? I, I am in love with Jesus, with my walk. I'm gonna give you my two cents of what blessed is. As Christians, we, we use that term too, a lot. But what does it really mean? Successful life, loving marriage, good kids that listen, <laughs> a great ministry, a healthy body, trusted friends, a great career, financial abundance. What a blessed life, right? I think I only scored like two of those. <laughs> you know, and I have to be honest, and this is just me, like my opinion. <laughs> if I was that, extraordinarily blessed without like knowing about God or even you know even at the beginning I guess you could say of my walk like I do now I I, I probably wouldn't be turning to him and I'm just being completely honest our hearts are I, I might feel like self-sufficient proud after all like it was my hard work that was paying off right I wouldn't feel a need to cry out to God for deliverance. Everything would already be perfect. I wouldn't need to trust God. I could trust myself. I would already be satisfied. My desire for God is greatly fueled by my need. I came to realize now that earthly blessings are temporary. They can all be taken away. Job, blessings, all of it can disappear in one day. I, I had a comfortable life at one time, the house, the business, the marriage, but it all was lost. I got caught, I went to prison, my dreams were shattered. But yet, in the midst of all those painful events, I met God. To me, that was my blessing. I experienced God's richest blessings in the most painful moments. A deeper love that I had ever known. Today I have such an intimate walk with him, I can't even explain it. My trials are grounded. While my trials were not my blessings in themselves, they were channels for them. So what I could tell you today is, hashtag, I am blessed to have salvation. I am blessed that my house is in order. I am blessed 
that my kids are starting to see the change in me. I am blessed with a, with a job. I am blessed with a new heart and this joy in my heart <laughs> that I just never had before. So like, I'm in love with Jesus. <laughs> my name is JC. I am blessed. I'll catch you guys on the rebound.